I say, I say, I say. How do rabbits go on holiday? I don't know. How do rabbits go on holiday? Well, they fly British Airways, of course. <laughs> I say, I say, I say. What do you call a teacher with a joke book on their head? I don't know. What do you call a teacher with a joke book on their uh, head? A teacher. Amazing. I don't know. <laughs> well, looks if you're all in. Let's just check by holding up some cue cards, see if you've been listening in English. Read them out as loudly as you can, okay? <laughs> It starts off pretty sadly, so let's have some violence. Thank you. 
two buttons, and this is my top teaser. Say hello, teaser. Oh, I'm Cinderella's best friend. She doesn't look very happy, does she? Best go find out the frog. Hello, Cinders. Hello, buttons. You don't look very happy. Aren't you going to the concert tonight? I simply can't, buttons. Look at the list of things my sisters are going to do for tonight. No wonder they know that the ugly sisters. Excuse me, you can't say things like that. Why not? Who are you? I'm Jack, the officer's inspector, and you can't call people ugly. It's just not done. But this is a panto. Now always called the ugly sisters. Besides, it's not because what they look like, it's because of the way they behave is so mean and ugly. I'm sorry, but you just can't say it. Oh yes we can, can't we boys and girls? Oh yes we can. Oh no you can't. Oh yes we can. Oh no you can't. Oh yes we can. I can see this fellow as a pit of pests. Let me try some fleas in his mess. Hey Cinders, an off-stage in spectacle Jack, a humour does suffer a lack. Then suddenly he starts twitching and scratching and itching. Let's move on before he comes back. Hello everyone! We come to brighten up your day with our wit and beauty! That's the biggest joke I've heard so far. My name's Anastasia, but my friends call me Nancy. My name's Augustina, but my friends call me Gusty. My name's Animos Fear, but my friends call me Musty. I can't think why. This is my new outfit. Do you think my bottom looks big? Oh no, dear. It looks ginormous.
better. I just wish I could make fall in love with me. I'm so lucky to have such wonderful friends. Aww. This cosy friendship makes me feel sick. True misery is what makes me tick. So I've hatched this brilliant, nasty ruse for naughty pity to use her moves. To be taken in by kind Cinderella and put this poison where I tell her. To feed it to Cinder's cuddly crew, they'll be dying to eat my deadly brew. Ha ha ha! Boo I'm sorry to interrupt, but this is one of those times I must complain about some of those wives. This fellow's going from bad to worse. I'll give him some time out with the three bears. What are you doing? Can't do this! This is one fair to take! When I said I want to a movie part, this was a white man. <laughs> On Naughty Kitty, we'll keep an eye. She'll be up to no good by and by. So, Rocky, I'm from Howdy Magazine. Your fans want to know everything about you, and I mean everything. You're public property now, you know. You could just answer a few questions. What do you eat for breakfast? Something yummy, I hope, as our readers will no doubt coffee you. How many girlfriends have you had? Have you ever had a pet? What was it called? Rocky has chocolate blocks for breakfast and works far too hard to have any time for girlfriends. I much have a very cute cat called Rover. That's all for now, thank a you. A cat called Rover? I've never had a cat in my life. And I can't sign Choco Pops. That's all very well, but we've got a promotion deal with them. She'll have to be seen eating them every now and again. You are going to look the business in this. It positively shrinks. S-T-A-R. If you could try it on, we'll see if it needs any tweaking. OK, let's have some poses for the photo shoot. Give me thinking, man. Mean and moody. Yoss in four. Okay, let's see. Rocky, Rocky! Sorry, Dan, I've made one. Sorry, Dan, I can't do this anymore. I just want to be ordinary and free to fall in love with the girl of my dreams. Hello, I think I love you. I bet you say that to all the girls you meet in your dreams. I've never met a girl in my dreams before. I've never been in anybody's dream before. Wow, that must be my moment for each other. Let's go for a walk. I've made my mind up. This will be my last concert. I'm going back to being plain old Prince Charming. I thought all of this rock star celebrity stuff was what I wanted, but it's not all this cracked up to be. Oh, come on now, Rocky. Don't throw it all the way. You don't want to be the one who's going to have to beg you to say. Oh, it's not too late, cracked up to be.
For you, Auntie King Baby Blue is a glassy in a shoe, important to accessorise in colours that bring out your eyes. Let's have those areas, I think. Your hairstyle really ought to say. This is a very special day. We need to look that's not bizarre, but leaves no doubt of who you are. Chop, chop, everybody. No time to waste. We've got to get this girl ready for the ball. The ball? Well, of course, my dear. You don't think I'd waste my time and talents on any old event, do you? <laughs>
didn't expect to get concert as well for the price of these tickets, did you? Cinderella will go for the ball. Her beauty quite unique. If the ugly sisters spot her though, they'll have a fit of peak. Very nasty boots plan was truly fooled. She's feeling very vexed. But enough now for chatter. Let's see what happens next. <laughs> I'll put this clock one hour behind and Cinderella soon will find all hopes of true love will be shattered when her prince sees her in her filthy tatters. Ha ha ha! <laughs> Let's welcome to the ball Mr and Mrs O'Dors and their daughter Patty. Patty O'Dors? <laughs> Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Ball and their son, and their daughter Katya. Katya Ball. Mm. Mr. and Mrs. Eckersley and their son Willie. Willie Eckersley. Mm. Anastasia. Augustina. <laughs> Aram Sophia. The princess. I think it's the most beautiful I've 
world. Uh, it's only 5 to 11. It, I can't believe it. It's just, it's as if everything's in slow motion when I'm with you. Oops. Just in time, there's such a big key for the ladies in the infill. And I can't run in wellies. This job is so much easier with wings, right? Midnight is nice, so there's much, much to do. Clock go back to the time is true. <laughs> I must get your name. Better be gone. Better! Wait! What's this? She's left her shoe! Dan! Dan! Whoever this shoe fits is the girl I'm going to marry. Get those PR people and make themselves useful. Put the word out. Something's afoot. And get, make some wedding arrangements. When I find my dream girl, I'm never going to lose her again. Rockefeller has ordered the most splendid wedding cake ever made. It's a cab with him and his bride on top. That's going to be me. Then perhaps I had better order a couple more kinds of icing sugar? I always knew I was destined for bigger things. Your bottom certainly seems to be. Ladies, please, you need to get started. I've got to leave plenty of help with this. Now what do you think is a pretty thing to get right? <laughs>
sure you'll hope for this romance. Aha, uh -huh. there's plenty of space in her sister's head to drop an idea to stop it dead. I'll bring up to mind their dank, dark cellar where they could lock up Cinderella. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Act 
Sorry. No, uh, stop. stop! 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 Get this man out of here. He's
So your boss and shame me miss your audition. He was rescuing me. Please can you give him another chance, Mr. Dini? Oh, go on then. What can you do? I can do limerick. Once an artist who called Rock Bella fell in love with our own Cinderella. So applaud to the rafters, happily ever afters, because nothing could be much more sweller. That's very good, boss, and it's very really good for you. And I've got a very special dog. Here, Tita. Sit. Roll over. Very good, just not very original. Would you like me to tell a joke then? Thanks for offering, but what did you say? I said, would you like me to tell a joke? Who said that? Who do you think said it? Me, of course. Rocky Robbins, I think I found the MBT. Bustin' and his amazing talking dog. That sounds good, but we'll have to see about the billing. So all that's happening, we've got our wings. All that remains is a sweet exchange of rings. We even have left over here some special fairy dust. Let's use it to transform nasty boots in a mean old puss. <laughs> someone a hug. But throw away my wallet and, and we'll be like bugs in the bark. I'm looking for a makeover project. A real challenge would be nice. You feel it perfect as a task. I'll get to do it thrice. <laughs> An obstacle? I've written new limerick. An off-stage inspector one day happened to come to our play. When his verdict he gave, he did nothing but what rave, and all the fairies went, Way, hey, hey! Hooray! Hooray.